Okay, so now we're at the point where we have our rails glued on, we have our lever arm finished, and now we need to actually get our bearings in there. What we're going to be using for a bearing is going to be a straw. So, you're going to take your straw out of your package, and then we need to cut this into four bearings. When you're cutting this into bearings, just make sure that they're um, four pieces. It doesn't have to be the entire length of the straw. It could be four small pieces, four big pieces, but they do have to fit through your rails and they should come out on both sides of the rail. So it should not be as small as the rail. So I have my four bearings. That's the size of my bearing. And now I could just place these inside of here. So I have four bearings on my car. One of the things I need to make sure of is that the bearing where the lever arm holds back to is inched out so it's not in the way of the lever arm. So if it is in the way of that lever arm, okay, then it's actually going to make it so when we tie the string around the rear axle, it's not going to be able to go. So make sure that that's out enough that's not going to be in its way. Now what you're going to do is you're going to take a dab of hot glue and put it on every side of those four straws. Just make sure that when you hot glue those four straws that your After you've cut your straw into four pieces, you're going to place them in like this. So all four pieces of straw go through your axle holes. Those are our bearings. One of the bearings I have to make sure of is across from this lever arm as I push my lever arm down, that that bearing doesn't come all the way through my rail. If that comes all the way through my rail, then what's going to happen is the string we tie to this will not be able to attach to our rear axle. It's actually going to get caught up or bind. So make sure this is on the outside. And now we're going to super glue these. When you super glue a straw, a plastic straw, make sure that you're only putting glue near the wood because what's going to happen is if you touch the tip of that hot glue gun to that straw is it's actually going to burn through and it's going to melt that straw. Not good. So I just like to put a dab of glue on each side of the straw and then tilt it the way you put the dab on. Then if you got enough room with your fingers not to touch the hot glue because you're going to burn yourself you could actually spin the straw inside of it inside of the rail and it'll actually move the glue around so it gets inside of there. So I'm going to put a dab of glue here, put a dab of glue here, put a dab of glue here, put a dab of glue inside of here. Okay. Now I got all that glue, take my fingers, spin it around my straw, take my fingers again, spin around my straw. I'm going to give it a second. So then this will dry out, we'll put our axles through, and we'll assemble our wheels in the next video.